The event today was to test the tube climbers that uh, we've been spending um, a lot of time on since January, as well as loads of other universities in the region, uh, finally coming together to time them, get the fastest time, compete, meet up, being able to talk to other students from other universities, be able to see their designs, see where they've improved from us, see the different ideas they had, things that we never would have thought of. Hi, I'm Jonathan. I'm studying mechanical engineering at Brunel University. What I've enjoyed most about this event is the fact that it really makes use of your making skills, something that I'm particularly interested in as a mechanical engineer at this university. Because of my experience where graduates came into industry and they didn't know how to apply the knowledge they gained at university. So I wanted to find a way of exposing the undergraduates to the real world of engineering and then I introduced the design challenge. I have been impressed today with the students from Brunel University who incidentally have won the competition and they have come up with an extremely good design and they have achieved the full objectives of the challenge. They will of course be competing with the other regions in October and I'm sure they'll stand a very good chance of winning that competition. I'm quite impressed with the quality of the, the teaching and the enthusiasm of the individual students and the teamwork. It really is fantastic. All the students on the year have the same experience of developing a real device for real testing and that is important for their professional development. It's really nice that we've won today. We're the champions of the Greater London region. So Brunel keeps the cup for the second year running, gives us something to aim for for next year. I'm Kush Vakara, this is Akash Joshi, Jonathan Namar. We just won the second year design challenge for iMaki. At first, we had no idea what to do. We didn't know anything about pipe climbers building device, but we went through quite a few iterations as the processes that we used were not identical and some processes uh, provided better results than the others. We've learned that we should never give up and that working out as a team is the best thing. Hours before the competition, our devices felt that through resilience and teamwork, we've found out that we can fix problems and then go on and win the competition.